Hello everyone, I hope you all are doing great. Today in this video, we will be having a look at best aspects of Walchand College of Engineering Sangli. These insights aren't just mine, but are appreciated by fellow Walchandiates based on their own experiences. Before we begin, drop a comment sharing your expectations from your dream college for your career growth. And if you're a Walchandiate, let me know the top three things you loved about this college. Let's get started. I am very sure that everyone will agree to this point that most of the students at Walchand are quite competitive. One of the reasons behind this is that this is the cream layer of entire Maharashtra. The environment at Walchand is undeniably competitive, but let me clarify what that means here. It's not about being rude, strict or constantly rushing for a rat race. Instead, it's a healthy, positive competitiveness where students are always ready to help each other. In competitions, you'll often find two categories. Novice for first-year students and expert track, which includes students from second to final year. This setup gives you a glimpse into the level of competition at Walchand, where second-year students can go head-to-head -head with seniors in AI, ML, blockchain and cloud computing. This might seem overwhelming for juniors who have just finished their 12th grade. But that's where the supportive nature of Walchand DH shines through. Expert track students are always available with helping hand, making the transition smoother for newcomers. Still, some may find this difficult, especially introverts, but that's where the club culture comes in, which I'll discuss later in this video. To conclude the definition of competitive at Walchand is entirely different from the rest of the world. Walchandiats believe in learning in public, embracing challenges and growing together. And what else can be the great example other than massive success at DKTE College, where all three places were captured by Walchandiats only. Ah, uh, extracurriculars. It's a never-ending topic, and I've revised this same script multiple times, yet I'm still not able to cover the whole topic. Most of the Walchandiats can relate to this. Walchandiats face more extracurriculars than academics. That's because there's something always going on every week. I've already covered our initial experiences of extracurriculars in previous videos, and that's not even 10% of what we actually experience here. Extracurriculars include the Freshers' Party, Success Party, various club activities like CSR, hackathons, various competitions like real competitions, coding competitions, debates, group discussions, events, mega events like TEDx events and vision, fests, sports, gatherings, cultural activities like Ganesh Chaturthi, Traditional Day, Bollywood Day, Halloween Day, Walchand Eve, Mr. and Miss Walchand, Walchand Shri, DJ Nights, Stand-Up Comedy, and so many things. We cannot even cover all these things in a single video. Extracurricular activities at WCE are on another level. So many students come here just to attend these things from other colleges, from nearby cities. Extracurriculars help students to get to know others, build connections across branches and evolve. And now placement's the only reason why we are studying, why we are putting such great efforts. Actually, around the corona period, the packages at WCE was literally on its peak. So many students got placed in FIN companies with massive CTC. Literally almost all of the CSE students from that batch has gotten the dream packages. But today's situation is kind of different because of recession and AI. And let me clarify what that means here. Surely it's going to affect the packages, but think about this. Even cutting the packages into half is still better than other colleges. Grabbing a 25 LPA package that too during recession is excellent. Let's now talk about internships as this is the phase of internships and hirings. So last week Atlas Copco visited and nine students got selected and we all wish you the best. And this week Siemens is coming. So to sum up we don't have to worry. That's because we are Walchandiates and we surely going to get placements better than others. And you just saw the live proof 25 LPA that too in recession. And in our opinion and according to majority of the Walchandi 8s, this phase is going to end soon. That's the main three reasons why Walchand is literally in the top three colleges in entire Maharashtra. These three things play strong role in career growth during college life in any college. Making such videos is very time consuming process. Good quality takes time. And at last we would love to address your questions. Yeah, most of us are part of PACE. We believe in personal growth and development. Thanks buddy, our video editors truly outshine the rest. Their talent knows no bounds. Last year the CSE cutoff for a general male candidate was 99.25. 
For further details, please check the college website. Absolutely, JEE scores are accepted. With scores around 94-96, you can secure a good branch. We don't usually recommend college hostels, but that's where you'll experience true college life. It's an adventure worth embarking on. The cutoff for reserved categories is usually lower than the open categories, but aim for 99 plus to secure your spot. Including mess, hostel and college fees, it totals around 1.3-1.4 lakhs per year, with college fees being only 85,000 rupees. After watching this video, choose according to your preferences. We highly recommend WCE for its exceptional opportunities. We've dedicated a separate video to answer this question. Check it out for detailed insights. Absolutely not, while well, Chandits won't tolerate these things, not even during exams. Yes, we have a dedicated sports club to foster athletic talents and promote a healthy lifestyle. As we approach the last month, it's crucial to stay focused. During our time, we dedicated six hours daily to mock tests. It's a proven strategy for success. At last, I must confess, I too cannot reveal my identity. Nevertheless, we all trust that you'll embrace my narration with open arms. Keep thriving. Keep exploring. Until next time, take care and goodbye.